It's nfan 97203 here, and we're back at it again. Alright, so, continuation of my Halo 3 playthrough. I'm really excited to be back at this again. Um, now we're doing Floodgate. I'll uh, probably be able to finish this one pretty quickly and move on to the beginning part of the arc. Um, so yeah. Really, really exciting. It followed me home. Yes, it did. Damn it. Okay, I didn't get to keep the weapons that I had last time. Which kind of sucks, because I had a shotgun. But at least now I have a battle rifle again. No, I didn't make it. Damn it. He drops one of the skulls. Uh, I don't remember which one it is. Alright, grenades. And this. I will take this, fam. Alright. Okay, so this actually... The, the SMG actually has more ammo in the magazine. Never mind. I thought the spiker did, but... I guess not. The spiker still looks cooler. Let's be honest here, though. No! I'm saving as many of you as I can. I'm sorry, Marines. I tried so hard and got so far. But in the end, it doesn't even matter. I don't even know what that accent was. Don't ask. Don't know. At all. No. No. Really hoping that at least one of Okay, SMG is out of ammo. So, yeah. See, look at that. They had about the same amount of ammo, maybe a bit less for the spiker. And, uh, well, look which one lasts longer. Not by much, but still. Whoop. No! 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 You ain't coming back to life. I don't want to have to kill you again. No! I <laughs> got a lot of kills from that. Marines, hold out! I believe it you. I'm, I'm keeping the shotgun for sure. I'm probably... Yeah, I'm gonna go with the SMG over the battle rifle. I like the battle rifle a lot, as you guys know. But, it, against the flood. Let's be honest here, it's maybe not the best. Great against Covenant. Love it. Love it to bits. Not always the best against flood. I mean, potentially you could use it effectively, but... Not... I'm not really gonna take that chance. I already have full shotgun ammo, so I'm not worried about picking that up. Just pepper the large horde. I'm telling you, the SMG just seems to go through ammo quicker. Like, now that I'm legitimately comparing... Because if you guys haven't seen the last episode, in the last episode, I mentioned how I like the spiker, the brute spiker, more than the SMG. And personally, now I know that time I was just firing off the SMG, not the spiker. So, um, so that that may be a little bit biased for that last bit, but I don't know. I'm kind of glad that this episode I get to properly compare them. That's cool. I'm not gonna complain about that. Put a few rounds into him though. I don't want him getting back up. See the SMG again. A lot of SMGs and spikers in this level. It's kind of odd, because, you know, there's a lot of spikers in the level before this. Not many SMGs. But you might think, well, why does that matter? Well, because you fought through the same exact area in the last level. Last level, it seemed to be more, like, battle rifles and, and shotguns and stuff. Oh, I had bubble shield? I didn't know that. 
I was like, oh, deployable cover, sure, I'll take that, I guess. I didn't know I had a bubble shield. Can I just get through, please? Thank you. I don't know why I had trouble with that. Assault rifles, battle rifles. I'm not too worried about that. Oh, that's right, there's a ton of you. Uh, I forgot how many of you there were. There's still more. This is why we usually grab the flamethrower. I'm gonna swap one of these out with the SMG. Then they use two different ammo sources. Yeah, the SMG definitely has more ammo, but I feel like it just goes for the ammo quicker. I don't feel like it does any extra damage for it. And here's this Marine. <laughs> I'm sorry, mate. I ain't... I ain't gonna let my people live like that. Like, some people let... You know, it's your choice if you let that guy live or not. You don't have to kill him to continue the mission. There's no objective for it. I just... I don't want to let that guy just sit there having mental breakdowns all day. I... I prefer not to. I mean, he had the pistol up against his head. He was probably gonna kill himself anyway. I wonder how many people in the comments section would be like, You asshole, you killed him. What the hell did he ever do? He was a saint, and then and then he was tortured, and you killed him because of it. You horrible, horrible person. And I'll be sitting here like, bitch, fuck off. I'm not excited for those comments. Usually, you know... I'm sort of excited for the comments. It's kind of funny to see what kind of crap some people say. That's just so stupid. Or so... So grammatically incorrect. That's like, you, you... You, sir. How did you get past grade school? Don't explain that to me. And other times I actually get legitimate nice comments. I've actually gotten a few of those recently, which is really freaking surprising. Like, if you guys know the people that watch my video, it seems to be all people who absolutely hate me, or just don't leave comments. I don't know why. <laughs> like, seriously, take a look at the comments on my videos. It's, it's hilarious. But recently I've gotten a few half-decent comments. And by half-decent, I mean legitimately nice, kind comments. I'm like, hey! I almost maybe possibly have some fans who don't hate my guts and want me to die in a hole. That's kind of cool. Still gonna go die in that hole, though. Waste of this ammo. Ooh, ooh, where was that rifle? No, that's not it. Crap. Alright, well, I've crapped on the ammo for this now, though. This is uh, not what I meant. I was looking for this. Oh, this has like no ammo. Look at that. I'll keep these. These have full ammo right now. It's like full ammo over like no ammo any day. Ooh, ba doop! But I will take not getting ambushed over getting ambushed any day also. And it looks like uh, I get to be ambushed. That's fun. These just feel like they're not going through ammo as quickly. Maybe it's just because there's more ammo. Well, I should say, another thing that I like about the Spiker is that it's a Covenant weapon, which at first you might be like, okay, why does which team it's on matter? But if you've actually played the games, you know it really, really does. Because, you know, you're always fighting Covenant and Flood and crap. I don't think there's ever been a mission where I couldn't find a Covenant weapon on the map. 
where I couldn't find, you know, ammo for Covenant weapons throughout the place. You know, if you, if you aren't finding much ammo on the map, if you, you know, if you're using Famine, you know, the Skull Famine, and you always use that, you probably often use Covenant weapons. Because there are just so many on the map from all the dead Covenant, or on missions where you're just fighting Flood, you'll often find a, you know, a ton of them being used by Flood. Because Flood used both human and Covenant weapons. Or if you're playing a mission... I mean, Halo 4 kind of breaks that, you know, Halo 4 and 5, when you're fighting Prometheans, you don't find Covenant weapons as much. But like, in the original trilogy, and Halo Reach, <laughs> and Halo 3 ODST, you know, it's like, oh, you know, I'm not finding a lot of ammo throughout this mission. I'm probably going to end up using Covenant weapons most of the time, because they're probably going to be the only weapons where I can find ammo. So, you know, say you're, you're choosing to use the SMG, over the spikers here, you know, because maybe you, you like the SMG better. Funny thing is, I, I'm not actually even arguing with anyone about the SMG, I'm just telling you guys why I like this over the SMG, because I can see people potentially liking the SMG more. Not saying I don't like the SMG. SMG has definitely got its place. But, I mean, you can see, I'm out of ammo now, but that's because I've been using nothing but these, and you know how many flood I've just mowed through. This is actually technically a human area, so there's a lot of human weapons here. And even with that, it seems like there's more spiker ammo than there is SMG. Um. Oh, you're fun. Take you down. Um. I don't know, just in general, I feel like the spiker is better. I wish that the spiker or other, you know, brute and just general weapons with blades on them did more melee damage. Like, you know, maybe if you're using the spiker, it'll it'll do like 150% of melee damage compared to just the normal 100%. So that it's like, oh, you know, something takes three melees to kill, well now it only takes two. You know, it's, it's, it's you know, it'd be something cool because it does have that blade. Or maybe a random chance of it doing double damage. Maybe it's not a common chance, just just a little chance, you know? I don't know, I think that could be kind of cool. Okay. Alright, you know what, we're going to pop the bubble shield because I'm getting tired of you people. Then again, most Flood use melee things, so that went really bad for me because now I was stuck in the bubble with them. That was a bad idea. That was a really bad idea. I'm an idiot. Don't do what I did. I mean, you can use the spikers. Those are good. Where do I go? Arb oh. Probably through the doorway. Alright, you guys can probably hear me just mashing down both triggers. It gives it... It's still full auto, but it's a slower full auto. Because you're more tapping it. Not a lot slower, but it is, it is slower. And personally, I feel like it's just easier to stop with this full auto. And easier to stop shooting and kind of correct your accuracy kind of stuff. So you're not wasting as many bullets. I don't know. It's not a huge difference, but it's one of those little things that I do. I've done, done it for a while. Right, I'm gonna head down here. Because there are flood down here, and flood have died down here. Thanks, brute, elite, wherever you are. Okay. Oh, great! I'm down to three shots. Alright, time to find a new weapon. But watch, as I'm most like- yep, covenant weapon. Right off the bat. Yeah, I mean, look at this. I'm dual-wielding covenant weapons. I can dual-wield the same covenant weapon. No problem. Legitimately, no problem. There's that, because I saw you coming, and I knew that was going to happen. I'm not going to lie, that didn't work exactly how I planned for it. Oh, God! I thought I still had the other one. 
Apparently not. Apparently not. I guess at some point I lost it, and that was close. That was far closer than one. Look, look at this. Look how quickly this SMG is just going through the enemy. What's that? I don't know, it just seems st stupid amount. I mean, I mean really. Alright, I'm gonna take... Energy Sword. Energy Sword and Shotgun. Let's do this. Come here. Beat the shit out of you. We can just ignore them, because you really just have to go over here and then the mission ends. There's nothing, like, legitimately I have to fight nothing else now. I'm not joking. It doesn't matter if you're out of ammo at this point. I can waste all of my ammo on both of my weapons and refuse to pick anything else up. And it, it won't matter. I won't have to fight anything else. Full 100 ammo energy sword. Look at that. Yeah, I don't need it. <laughs> uh, I wonder what that liquid is. It's. It's not. It's like kind of clear, but also it has a white tint to it. I'm not sure if I want to know what it is. It, it kind of looks like watered down milk to me, but I, it's probably something very disgusting, because this is flood, but. I hate it when he does that. It's already annoying when Cortana does that to me, but it's even worse when Gravemind does it. I would have 
You know, the first time I saw this cutscene, I kind of thought Master Chief had his hand on uh, Key's shoulder. And I saw as she kind of turned, wasn't... But just the angling there, it was like, is it? It's kind of hard to tell. Then again, when I first saw this cutscene, I saw it on a very small, like, box TV. So, see how that worked out. <laughs> So, that is all for this episode. I actually thought we'd get into the Ark some. I guess we are not going to be starting the mission of the Ark, as uh, it is 22 minutes in. So, hope you guys have enjoyed this video, or at least found it somewhat comedic. Uh, like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.